Okay, so quick and dirty, here's my idea for a study. Purpose of the study is to test whether inroad really is a key stimulus or not. So we're gonna take a subject, and the subject is gonna serve as his own control. We'll start off on the left side of the body. Um, we have lots of machines available to us where we can do unilateral training, despite hit and super slow objections to unilateral training. For the purpose of this study, we'll do it. Left side, smooth, slow, continuous repetitions to complete failure plus deep inroad. Get those total number of reps. Let's say you made six reps. Take that over here on the right side of the body. Do six reps, same form, except you're going to avoid inroad. Let's say we're gonna do six repetitions. We're gonna take two minutes rest between each repetition so as to avoid inroad to the greatest degree possible on the right side. Do this for 20 weeks throughout the entire body and then do an MRI. Do it at precisely measured levels at the nipple line, the umbilicus, mid thigh and mid shin and calculate muscle volume. Then wait 20 weeks and then do a crossover. By using each person as their own control, you don't need as many numbers in the study to have power. But having multiple subjects would also allow us to tell whether there are certain people that respond to inroad and there are certain people that respond better to avoidance of inroad. But I think this is a very simple study that needs to be conducted. Thanks.